We we smooth today? A smooth galaxy? Sounds good to me. Alrighty, hello everybody and welcome back to the channel and welcome back to No Man's Sky. And uh, we left off the last episode in this little place here. We we, we pissed off the guy. He, he wasn't happy with me because I came in and I was flashing my gun around and he he, he, he felt intimidated is what he did. Um, but uh, there wasn't actually anything else here. I did have another look around. There's nothing... No, nothing? Whoa, 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 what's happened to my accent here? Um, there's nothing of use here, nothing else I can take anyway. But um, I'm sort of getting to the point now, because I have explored a little bit of this uh, off of camera as well, and I, I haven't actually found much else that's new. I mean, there's, there's some beautiful plants. I mean, this is like the only plant for miles. Do you see another one? Anywhere? Anywhere at all? No. There's just like, these little flickering things. I don't... I don't know what they are either. They're like little, little tiny plants. There's a lot of little uh, bases and things around here, but nothing particularly special. I mean, I can just go around collecting these little fucking pets up and shit, but I, I, I don't really think that's achieving much in the grand scheme of things. It's just getting me some uh, points with the Corvax. So I think what I'm probably going to do is I'm probably going to move away. You know, we, we only just got here. Hold on a second. What the hell's going on here? Not a, not a fuel. What the hell? I'm pretty sure that was fine before I was the thruster. I see. Okay, well, I got plenty of plutonium, so just just eat it all. E eat it all. Right, okay. We can take off now. And oh my god! I just filled it to 100% and it's down to 75 already. Why is there just a random crosshair right there? Is there any. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the fuck? I'm nowhere near the ground. That's, <laughs> That's a bit weird. Alrighty, alrighty, we're up in the sky, we're feeling the, we're feeling the green vibes here. I mean, it, <laughs> the, the last planet I was on was like, heavily green as well. So, um, what I want to do today is I want to escape this, this planet and I want to go somewhere else. I want to see if we can find the promised land. And I feel like the promised land is going to be exactly where it's telling me to go. For once, I'm going to listen to the game. And I'm going to, I'm just going to sit back, I'm just going to relax, and I'm just going to say, you know what, No Man's Sky? I'm a brain dead idiot. Just tell me what to do. Tell me what to do. We're gonna go to uh, Dockleod. Etchkin. Great sounding place, right? Pulse engine, here we go! And away we go. And it uh, looks like we're gonna be there in a minute? A minute, are you kidding me? Are you telling me I gotta hold these buttons down like this for a minute? Well. I suppose I'm going to have to cut this part out, aren't I? <laughs> I mean, when you think of like a pulse engine, you think... That sounds pretty quick, right? It sounds pretty like from point A to point B. You know, like Star Trek or some shit. Not in this game. Nah. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Oh my god, we should stop right right now. Oh my god. Oh, that always gets me. Whoa. <laughs> it just keeps going and then it like almost like jolts. What the fuck is this? What the fuck am I looking at here? Don't tell me that this planet as well is a heap of shit. Because I'm just going to write off this entire solar system if that's the case. Because I don't see anything but craters. Here we go! Oh, there we are. My oh my. Doesn't this place look beautiful? <laughs> oh, wow. Let's head over here. All right, I, I can see what looks like another abandoned building. And these weird square things. What the hell are these? All right, okay. Initiate the landing. Come on, get us down to ground. I'm feeling a little bit, a little bit sick. Dead planet. Weather, fair. Sentinels, minimal. Flora lacking. And fauna. You telling me there's no animals here either? Oh, come on. I can't believe I've landed on another shithole. Look at this. A shithole with mushrooms. You know what my next question is going to be? Can I eat the mushrooms? And maybe this place will, will, will be a little bit more colourful and full of life. Got them, them mad 4K textures going. Oh, oh, what is this? Ew. Can I, can I step in this shit? 
It was making like a weird like squelchy noise when I was walking there. Is there something under my feet? I don't want to be stood in... I thought that shit was floating right then. <laughs> no, there's, there's, there's nothing here. It's just like some red goop on the floor. Some more iron. I suppose we could go ahead and save it. I mean, that, that makes the most sense, doesn't it? You know? Let's save the game. Mandy, let's not die. Let's not get stuck on a chair again. I don't, I don't think anyone's going to forget that, to be honest. Nothing found. We've got some... Ooh! Grantine. All right, I'm, 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 I'm curious. Uh, okay, a soft, workable alloy, flavored. <laughs> Apparently, my English has gone out the window because that does not say flavored, Monday. For fuck's sake, <laughs> soft, workable alloy, favored by artisans throughout the known galaxy. A popular trading good with many galactic shipping paths devoted to its sale and transport. Okay, so. Yeah, it's just another thing people would... Oh! I just noticed how much that's worth. That's a lot of money. That's a lot of units, Grand Scene, bro. Thank you for finding your way into my inventory. It's nice to have lots of units coming in here, and I'm going to be selling that immediately. But let's be real. Are we actually going to find anybody to sell it to here? There's just more plutonium here. Nothing exciting. We need to um, sort our life support again. For goodness sake, this shit is going down so quick here. Well, you know, I, I suppose it makes sense because I did put that mod on that increases the rate at which things deplete. So, you know, the survival experience, it's its coming. Slowly and surely, it's... it's oh, oh, what the hell, man? Are you kidding me? Is that that? That is that tentacle again. Oh, God. I swear to God. All right, if I... Ah! Coming in. Oh, you son of a bitch. Twice. It's not even... No, I, can't, I can't get my gun out. Why would you do this? Why would you make it so I couldn't get my gun out to shoot that fucking thing up there? Huh? Every time I walk through this door now, he's gonna get me. You piece of shit. You... Oh, you bastard. You think you're smarter than me, huh? You think you're smarter than me, huh? You think you... You think he, he, he doesn't die. All right, that's it. Hold on a minute. Oh, hello. Is that Sean Murray? I just wanted to say, mate. You're a massive cock. Just listen to me, all right? I'm upset about the tentacles. Yeah? Yeah. You know exactly what I'm talking about. You put them inside the fucking doorway without the ability to get my gun out to kill it. What, what is that? Hmm? Oh, and uh, where, where are you? You hung up. Oh, well. I guess I gotta just fucking deal with this stupid tentacle being here now. Oh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on a second. Oh, are you kidding me? Just as I thought I could kill the little... Ah, I said, just, just take all my plutonium. Just, just take it all. All right. Let's see what you want here. Is this doing anything to him? Arr, you like that boy? <laughs> it's getting kind of hot in there. Huh? He is not dying. Can I melee his ass? You piece of shit. You piece of shit. You piece of shit. Oh my god. <laughs> How annoying is that? Oh my god. He is legitimately indestructible. Oh, this is a, this is an absolute joke. I suppose I'm gonna have to get hit by your ass again, aren't I? That's what's gonna happen here. You're gonna you're gonna just jump out of the shadows and get me again, huh? Well, we'll see about that. We'll fucking see about that. Yes, we will. You ready for this? I'm gonna trick this son of a bitch. And oh my god, it's gonna look so good. I fucking hate you. Well, even though this is like a, a massive troll in itself by Hello Games, I am going to go ahead and take their specimen because me and the Corvax like to bum each other so much that, you know, I might as well, I might as well make them happy with me. Uh, have we got anything else in here? If we've got more tentacles, I am going to, I am going to flip. Nope. Just random patches of, of gloop. I'll have that over tentacles any day. Uh, a lot of the doors in these places don't actually open, even though they're seemingly very large buildings. There's not actually anything in them of, of use. There's just more health down here. Like, I know it's procedurally generated, but it is a bit annoying because 
<laughs> I've got to stand next to this fucking thing whilst I touch this. Give it a rest, will you please? I've got to play with the terminal. Do you not understand that? Oh, I see you, you motherfucker. Oh, I do see you indeed. <sighs> Just you wait. Just you wait. I'll be gone very shortly. And you're going to be left here all by yourself. How does that make you feel, huh? How does that make you feel? You're going to be lonely. Maybe that's what it is. Maybe he's just lonely. Well, I'm going to interact with this without standing next to it. You see, that's how you do it. All right. The oceans here are blood. Nothing lives in them. They are alive themselves. Well, that's fucking disgusting. Great protein life forms. I don't know what that means. Uh, as large as continents, or perhaps there is only one of them. What does such a thing consume, I ask myself? The answer seems to be everything. It's, it's official. At this point, I would rather be back on Planet Wrecked, sniffing some alien fetor. I found evidence of past life here, but no signs of it. Does the native flora and fauna hibernate when it comes to eat them, then return and repopulate once it retreats? I can feel it moving inside my brain, whispering. It, it wants me to discard my suit and... What the fuck is this, man? What is this shit? Well, I, I, I'll see what's in your data log anyway. I discovered something coded deep inside the long dead traveler's... Yeah, 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 yada, yada, yada. What is it? It's a life support module toll. Toll. Energy boost. Okay, we haven't got the description again. It's something else i got to figure out game's making it too easy you know this is this is hard mode right here it's trying to figure out what the what the hell this stuff is okay is there anything i can get rid of i don't want to get rid of the thamium do i have any on my starship please tell me i got some thamium here i do have some thamium so i can go ahead and move that across off you go my son all right let's see what this uh what this is all about here okay all right well look i'm, I'm busy all right I'm, I'm trying to figure out what this thing is so you're gonna have to mess around with this. Oh, stupid woman. Oh, not not what you made me do. I'll come out of my inventory. God's sake. Uh, I was gonna see what this thing is. Obviously, I, I haven't sorted out the descriptions yet. I have no idea what mod is doing that. I'm still I'm still trying to figure it out. You know, it's it's a long and in 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 hard process. But um, right. It looks like something that's going to make the life support work a bit better. So I mean, in all fairness, I could test it and see. But, in all fairness, I don't need it. I do not need it. Uh, the stamina enhancement would be pretty cool, because then I'd be able to sprint everywhere. But, once again, it's just not necessary right now. It's it's not needed. And what is this? We've got another theta, accelerated fire. But then again, like, this is what I don't get. You, you, you're you given all these like, crazy upgrades, but then there's no, like, massive amount of mobs to kill. Like, if there was, like, shitloads of things raining from the sky every five seconds, then I'd be like, yeah, I need to upgrade some of this stuff. But right now, no. I do not need to upgrade anything. I am absolutely fine the way I am. In fact, whoa, Jesus, I nearly walked into that guy. What the, whoa, whoa, what the hell was that? Are you kidding me? I just got stuck. Well, Mr. Tentacle, I'm going to have to leave you alone now. I'm going to walk out the door, and I'm probably never going to see you again. But, um... If I see any of your brothers or sisters, I'm going to kick their ass, okay? Just, just let you know. All right? You're going to... You're going to... Fuck it. Yeah. <laughs> that was a total fail. What the hell? Don't you... Please. Please give me... It's just not possible. All right, anyway. Uh, okay, let's see if there's anything else uh, that we can go and explore. That beacon over there is... Four hours away. On foot. All right, no. No, 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 no. <laughs> We're getting the ship for this one because I am not walking for four hours. I mean, I wouldn't want to walk in real life for four hours anywhere. So it's not happening in a game. Thruster is down to... Th Are you kidding me? I get four fucking launch thrusters before it's depleted again. Annoying. Okay, one hour to get there. So um, once again, I might be doing either a speed up or, a, or an edit. It's probably just going to be an edit. I'm a bit of a lazy bastard like that, you know? <laughs> well, it turns out I've got like five minutes until I get to this actual beacon, which is a bit of a pain in the ass, if I'm totally honest. It's, <laughs> it's not fun flying around, you know? It's, it's, there's nothing to do. Um, but I, I may as well just talk to you for a little bit. But um, I, I haven't uploaded a video for the last week because uh, I have been in 
a world of pressure and stress and pretty much everything else that is just not good for the human body, the human spirit. But um, it's, it's been a really tough week for me at, at work this week. They've asked me to work a lot of overtime. I've had to come in and work set overtime and then I get moaned at by people. And usually I'm the guy doing the moaning. So when someone moans at me, I moan at them, we get an argument. I don't know, it's, it's just been a really crap week. After every day at work, I'd get home, I'd sit down and I'd just think, you know what? I am just in no mood right now to make a video. It really bums me out because YouTube is like, is like my main hobby. It's the thing I love doing. And I love playing games. It's one of my favorite things there is to do in this, in this lifetime. You know, apart from banging birds and eating food. They are the three best things. Right, well, seeing as I'm out of the atmosphere here, I'm going to go ahead and pulse jump this bitch because I am not waiting five minutes to get my... A. Am I, am I still pulsing? I'm not, I'm not still pulsing, am I? Oh my god, it keeps sucking me into the bloody atmosphere. Stop doing that. <laughs> what the hell is this? It, it's actually going up now. So even though I'm moving towards it, it's telling me that I'm further away. I don't, I don't get certain aspects of this game. I really don't. I, I don't get it. I don't, I'm going back out. Apparently, the only way to get stuff done around here is to do a pulse jump, which is fucking annoying. Right, okay, let's, let's move far away from the atmosphere don't get, so I don't get sucked into it again. And hopefully, we can pulse jump our ass right the way to it. Right, where is it? It's all the way over there? Oh my goodness, okay, right. Pulse jump. Over here. Just a little bit, not too far, don't go too crazy. If I could just, <laughs> if I could just control this thing, my god. And now it's over there. This is so very confusing. Space is a, is a confusing place. Here we go. Now we mean business. Now we mean business. It should be right underneath us. If I could just, <laughs> if I could just turn this baby around. All right, here we go. Here we go. All right, it's right underneath us now, so it can't possibly escape us like it has done the last like five times. Ah, there we are. Finally. That took a long, long time. This had better be worth it, Beacon. You'd better be something good. Right, can we pitch up here? I know it's on the side of a mountain, but... Yes, we can! <laughs> I mean, that's that. That's just a perfect example of, of my ship's amazing ability to deal with gravity. I just want to say, like, I know I've given this planet a bad name, but the terrain is insane. I mean, Christ, that's a mountain over there. We're on the side of a mountain right here. Love it. All I want to do now is find a lush planet that looks like this with some water and stuff, and I am game. I am good. Good to go. Um, of course, it is the result of a mod. Um, I can't remember the exact name of the mod, but it's something that always the terrain. It's something like extreme terrain or, or some shit, but it, it makes things a lot more interesting, put it that way. Okay, so this is my first beacon, so I, I wonder what this thing does. A waypoint. Whoa. Okay, that's pretty cool. I like that. Okay, well, that gives us an objective. I mean, at least now we know where we're going. We have something to go and do. Uh, there's just some oxide in there. Nothing actually special here. So, uh, fingers crossed, there's actually going to be something good over there. All right, back to the ship then, I guess. So, I haven't actually been to an outpost before, so it might be interesting to see what is there. I mean, hopefully there's some, like, quest goodies and bits and pieces there. Maybe someone who can trade with me because I picked up that stuff that I want to sell. But, um, I think I'm gonna have to cut the episode here. I think I'm just gonna have to leave it because we have been recording for, like, 30 minutes. And I I'm trying to cut the length of the videos down slightly because... I can't do nothing for two hours whilst they render. It's just absolutely ridiculous. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching today's video, and I will see you all on the very next one. Ta-da!